Hey guys, Bardock here. Um, usually you don't see my face, so uh, I'm getting back into the YouTube, so let's go ahead and get this started. Hey guys, Bardock here. Uh, I know I said that earlier in my little intro thing there. Um, I just wanted to start making more videos for my channel. It's been kind of, I haven't been really making much in the past, how, I have no idea. It's pretty much since the comic shop closed, the first time, or I guess the one only time. And, um, I haven't been running those tournaments anymore, recording them and putting them online. So now, um, I have a YouTube channel and I got nothing to do with it. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to start doing something now, basically. I'm going to basic. I'm just going to show off my little Nintendo collection. You can probably see it along the top there. Um, it's been slowly growing. I've been. I started collecting my regular Nintendo games uh, about maybe a year and a half ago. Um, pretty much since I started growing this beard. Um, and. Eh, awesome beard, right? I mean, look at this thing. <laughs> Whatever. Um, <laughs> uh. Pretty much, I just wanted to show off my beard. That's that's actually the real reason why I started this video. No, actually, well, I'm going to um, basically my collection's been growing. It's up to 138 games now, and uh, <clears throat> it's 138 games. It's slowly growing. There's 800 something uh, Nintendo games licensed, I believe. I'm not, I'm not sure how many there are unlicensed. There's probably like I think 80 of those or something like that. But uh, anyway, I've been slowly collecting them, and I want to basically show them off. And in the future, I'm going when, as I'm collecting games, I'm going to show those off as well, and then talk about them in detail as I'm showing them, and tell you how what I think of them and that kind of thing. Um, I don't know why you would care, but I mean, I'm doing this just for me and whoever else is interested. And uh, so far, the games that I have, it's kind of hard to talk about a lot of games at once. So what I'm going to do is, um, for this video, I'm going to try to keep this video short. I'm going to just show you all the games that I have. And um, I'm going to speed it up. It'll be like a time-lapse thing with some music or some shit. And um, I'm just going to show those off. And then in the future, maybe like every week, um, I'm going to play those games. And then make a video and talk about... Like, uh, try to keep them short, maybe like five to seven minute videos covering five games and just talk about them and w what my experiences are of them. So, uh, so let's ho go ahead and get this started. Um, hopefully it won't take too long. Thank you. 
Okay, guys. Whew, that was all of them. Um, I made a little wall of them here, as you can see, and um, barely get it in here. Let's show you guys. Um, all together. Um, I did my, I redid the math. I just counted them. I don't know why it's inaccurate, but I actually have 136 games. Um, each one of these rows has 22 games in it, and this row here has 24. Two more extra, as opposed to this one. So, 22 times 6 makes 132, plus 4 is 136. So I have 136 games here, and uh, I hope I really said that right. I'm not sure. I'm going to have to find out in the replay. Um, if you noticed, in some of here, there are some uncommon ones, but for the most part, most of these games are pretty common. Like, <laughs> I mean, most of these games I got for about, like, three bucks, three to four bucks each, and, um, in some places I could buy the games for, I could buy three and then get the last one free, so a lot of these games I actually got for free, which is pretty cool. Um, well, I should say about a four for these games I got for free, so, it's a plus, I guess. And, um... A lot of these games are just like a lot of bundle deals. You just buy, you buy three, you get one for it. I mean, you'd be surprised at how many, how many places do that with these old classic games. So yeah, um, you might have noticed uh, back to the commons and the uncommons. You might have noticed some rare ones like, well, let's see. Uh, you might have noticed that I had um, the Castlevania games. I have all three, which is awesome. I've only beaten the first one. Um, I have. <clears throat> I have some of the classics like Metroid here and uh, uh, Adventure Island. I even have 1942 somewhere, but that game sucks. So, I mean, I consider that a classic. But for the NES, that game sucks. I gotta get 1943. That's where it's at. So, that game's freaking badass. And there's some shitty games I have in here like Karate Champ. That game's so fun for the arcade, but by God, that game sucks. Um, and then there's Mike Tyson's Punch Out. Um, I got Mike Tyson's punch out because, I mean, you get to fight Mike Tyson. Who doesn't want to do that? Um, you might also notice that I had Ninja Gaiden 2. I also have Ninja Gaiden 1. I don't have 3 yet. I can't wait to get my hands on that, but damn, this game's so expensive. Oh, there's 1942, you piece of shit. Um, there's also Star Voyager. Like, there's just some shitty games in here. Star Voyager is just fucking... I hate that game. Um, I mean, I played it for like 15 minutes. I tried. I really did, but that game just sucks. Um... <laughs> Well, I'm not doing a review on these games, <laughs> but, um, yeah, a lot of these games are really cheap, I got them for pretty cheap, and a lot of the time I just buy them if they look interesting, like, fucking, like, Kid Nicky is just, like, like this, this is how I usually buy a game. Put this up here, I'll go do one of these, and as I'm going through the browser through the games, I look at it and I go, like, Kid Nicky, first it's pink, and it's like, Kid Nicky. And it's like, Radical Ninja. That just sounds badass. And then you see this dude fucking with a sword, and there's like a chick, and like, just like, what the fuck is this, right? And it's just like, you gotta buy it. And let me just say, like, newsflash, it sucks. <laughs> but, that's for another time. Um, but yeah, a lot of these games are pretty, f pretty interesting to buy, just from the way they look. And I will... Hopefully in the future, be doing little tiny reviews of each game, showing off game footage and that such thing. And, uh, I'm really looking forward to it. It's going to be a lot of fun. I mean, I like making videos. I like just talking about stuff. And, I mean, I don't get a lot of hits on these videos, so you guys who are watching my videos, you guys, you guys are, you're the ones I'm doing this for. And for me, too. So, yeah. That's pretty much it. Um... There's really not much else. There's really not much else I could say about this. I'm gonna play these games. I'm gonna. So far, I beat I think five of them so far, and I'm going to put them on YouTube. The playthroughs. I have the whole entire gameplay of my playthrough of every game. Like I try to play these games in one sitting, and I try to beat them, and I record it, and I keep it for myself. But um, some people were telling me I should 
put these online just me beating it along with my audio commentary because I record that too um, or just the game it doesn't really matter but uh, I was just think I was thinking about putting them online I don't know yet uh, tell me what you guys think down below and um, that's pretty much it so I'm gonna try to keep this short and I don't know if I did I guess we're gonna find out when I'm done editing the video and uh, yeah I'll see you guys later you guys take care